right there is deadly if yeah. you try to go over it. Yeah, the and stuff. Yeah. So they've got warning floats here. You do not go over this dam. If you look, you can see the boiling point. Look at the water. You see where it goes back toward the dam? And then the water that's on the other side goes downstream. You can die very, very, very easily right there. Yeah, that's why you don't ignore buoys or signs that say get out. Let me see. Here, right here, there's a line. You can't see a line, but you can see that all the water here is headed toward the dam. And if you get, even if you get your boat over, if you don't get past that point and get pushed out away from the dam, your boat will get sucked down and you're done. Even if you have a life jacket on, even if you have a PSD on, even if you're a really strong swimmer, you are done for. Yeah, so, I mean, that's powerful water right there. And then Mike decided to make an experiment and throw in this big stick. Okay. There's one. And there goes the other one. So let's see what happens with these sticks. They go down. <laughs> they will go down. See what happens. First one went over. And there it pops up. And it's right there by the edge. And then it goes down again. And here comes the other one. Up, went up, up, went down. Did you see how, where it came up? That's where that boiling point is. It comes up and then it gets sucked back. Oh my gosh, look, there they are. They both got sucked back toward the dam and they went down, go up, get sucked back toward the dam. That's what would happen to you. That's exactly what would happen to a person, no matter how good of a swimmer they are. That's what would happen to a boat. No matter the size of the boat, it's super dangerous. And we are paddling down the Mori River today. And we just had a fantastic time in a little waterfall area. Yep. I hope you enjoy our video today. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. All that stuff. All that stuff. Thanks. Bye.